Hi, this is River Dodio. We are out here in the garden with Kintaro, and that's because we did a little bit of a uh, self help. And uh, this video is for all of you who have older speakers and you have speaker cones which are getting old, like these Alnicos from the late 60s, probably. And how you can tell that your cones are getting old when they don't look nice shiny black like this, but they look dull gray whitish. That's the time when they need some tender loving care. And you can rejuvenate them and make them look like these ones. They are now nice jet black and, and a little bit moist and wet. That's because I applied a layer of wood hardener on them and uh, this is Minvex wood hardener there are several different things that you can put on a driver for example Damar would be maybe a better choice however for me it wouldn't be such a good thing because here we have tremendously high UV and Damar is not UV stable like my cats, they can weather this heavy UV really well, but the Damar on the driver cones does not. So even though I have heavy tint on my windows, even through that heavy tint, they just get too much UV damage. And when you have Damar on your cone, Damar will uh, look very ugly after 5-10 years. So that's, uh, that's not an option. We have tried it out on the island here and, and it will look uh, pretty bad. And when it's time to change it, well, there's no easy way to remove it. And you pretty much have a pair of ruined drivers five, 10 years in the future. However, Minvex wood hardener is similar substance as Damar. It is basically uh, some, I don't know what it is but it, it has a lot of solvents in it and when you apply it on the cone the solvents evaporate and leave the deposit inside in the cone and it's fluid like water so here how it is basically take a few just pour a little in a, in a small jar and it looks like almost like water and use a brush and with that brush just a little bit and apply it on the cone like that and do not apply it like here because if uh, there's too much fluid on your brush and and it drips down into the voice coil then you have killed your driver so always apply it from below up don't put it on your surround so do not apply it here just apply start like coming from here this is the safest area on the side and and just get to uh, know how much your brush soaks up sometimes a little sometimes a lot and 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 uh, when you touch the cone maybe there's hardly any left there or maybe the whole thing will just drip down right down down there and uh, however so right now the brush is dry I'm just showing what you should be doing and what I have done uh, I'm not risking it of doing the application while doing a video that's just a recipe to mm, mix up both ruin the drivers and ruin the video as well so now I'm showing it in a safe manner so basically I like start from here and you will notice that it can soak up too much uh, wood hardener so that when you touch the cone it will just drip down like almost like Niagara Falls so that's why when you dunk it in just touch it to the side to get rid of the excess fluid in it and and then just little by little apply don't use a big brush use the smallest brush you can and then little by little apply it and when you have applied enough and apply on the visor cone if you have visor cones apply it in if you have a wooden face plug apply it on the wooden face plug as well and when you are done with this side then flip over your speakers on their head 
and then finish the upside on the bottom. So that's how you do it and then afterwards let them dry. So this is how they look after they are being finished. So now they are ready for their uh, another decade or two or three of operation. And as you can see over there, you, over the top right there, there's some scratch marks. So I think that was probably Kintaro, that was him sinking his claws into the driver. So now, in addition to those big ports over there, I have three miniature ports on the driver as well. So we shall see. And I hope that uh, this little information was useful. So once again, this stuff is the Minvax wood hardener and just apply it with a brush on your driver cone and make sure just apply tiny bit by bit don't get it on the surround which is this material on the side avoid it just add to this bit and by the way this works for paper cone drivers do not apply it to aluminum or ceramic or other cones it won't work for that it's only for paper cones so when you have an older paper cone driver this is the way how you can add 10 20 plus years of life to their lifespan so thank you for watching happy new year everyone bye bye